Hey everyone, welcome back, it's day 31 here, and you can obviously tell that I am not in time with what's happening right now. I didn't get my audio today, I've been messing around with my USB connections a bunch, because I just got a solid state drive, and so the audio today did not record. The device just did not get set correctly from its new connection apparently. So yeah, I did a bit of a failed farm run there with the teleports, but we were we were just going for our burbs and herbs. I was trying to sort my mouse out a bunch too. Tech difficulties today is the name of the episode if you're wondering why it's only seven minutes long. But we got our burbs and herbs done, it was a decent run. The price of Renar is still not great at the minute. I did look up the herb sort of profits that we could be making from different types of seeds. And it turns out at the minute it's just better to do toad flax. I mean there are better options than that even, but we don't have the levels for them. Toad flax for us is the best option. And we already had six seeds in the bank, so I haven't bought any more seeds just left myself with the 2.4 mil that we've now built up to. So we're saying as well we alked a bunch of the items from the wilderness agility course so we did get a little more profit out of those than we initially expected but for the most part it wasn't that much it was like we got about 45k profit in total which isn't that much you know. 195k but we spent 150k so 45k profit not that great <laughs> uh, but yeah then the rest of the day i was just spending at sulfon and Gua, really we we have an upgrade of max hit now we can hit 1717 up from 1616 for our max of 34 thanks to the chivalry upgrade that was from you know, as soon as we got in there. But we did also gain a bunch of strength XP over the course of the day, all the way up to 63 by the end of it, which is a nice progress indeed. We got a bunch of hit points XP too, bit of attack XP because my DDS was on the wrong style, and some magic. My Alks were not as much as they usually are, like I didn't I didn't get as many in as I usually do. I was being a bit lazy with it, but I was also looking up things on the other monitor to do with herbs at the time and just chilling. Because yeah, it's hard work. But we did get 67 magic at some point during this. I can't actually see if it happened recently or not. Because my version that I'm watching right now is blurrier than yours because of CPU power. Yeah. So yeah, this is today's video. I'm sorry it's shorter. I'm sorry I didn't get my audio. We slapped lots of sulfonagur in the face and it felt pretty fucking good though. Got a decent amount of alks done. We're one level away from Blood Barrage now. And working towards it. Looks like we just got that level actually there. On the recording. If I can tell correctly. We're kind of slapping at the minute, like, we're almost clearing them out before they respawn, so... Things are going well in the melee training department. Oh, and I had a bit of a, a conversation with the camera about defenders, because I was thinking about it and, like, I wonder how many days it's going to take us to get a defender once we go to the Warriors Guild. Cause it could take us a long time to get a dragon defender so feel free to leave bets in the comments of how how many days do you think it takes me to go from zero defender to dragon it could be a piss take who knows it could take us a week just to get a bronze one if we get bad rng but yeah that's gonna be a grind that comes in the future at the minute, we are working towards 65-65 on the attack and strength, so we can get in there. And we made good progress on the strength there. Very solid progress. We got about 115k by the end of the day, I think. We're almost done on the sulfurs now. Just stayed for another 5 minutes or so. 
I also wanted to make sure I got to miscellaneous so that I could top up my cash a bit at the end of the day, which is why I left perhaps a bit earlier than usual. I just wanted to, again, it seems as though we've got like two mil disposable income in our invent at the minute. I was like, yeah, I need to put some of this in the coffers because the more money that's in those coffers, the more value you'll get out of it. So I did do that super quick after the birdhouse run, which I'm sure you'll see it was down to the wire. I literally just got the two mil in, in the last few seconds. Well, this is a lot easier to edit than a usual video, I'll tell you that. I basically just had to talk for 10 minutes rather than spend like an hour, but it's also way lower quality. So, you know, just that too. Ups and downs here on one hour limit locked. Yeah, you see our, our final XP rates there as I'm doing my wrap up and I suppose I'll be doing my wrap up here on the voiceover too. Uh, thanks for watching this weird, different episode. I hope it provided some entertainment for you all, or at least some insight as to the progress of the account. And all being well, we'll be back with episode 32 as normal tomorrow. Look after yourselves, be lovely to one another, and I'll see you on the next one.